Hey guys, Sarah Grace back with you for another Mythbuster Monday. Sorry about being MIA last week, but I had a 30 page paper to write and then went home for the weekend to travel, to be in a wedding of my best friend. So it was fun, you probably saw that. You saw my paper writing and coffee at eight o'clock at night and you saw the wedding festivities if you're following me on Snapchat and Instagram. If not, they're linked below. Anyways, let's get to Mythbuster Monday. And someone, actually a few people asked, can you spot train? Can you train just like say, do sit ups to lose weight in your stomach and to gain muscle in your stomach? So let's get to that question right now. And the answer is no. You cannot just pick a spot and work on that area and think that you're gonna see results in that area. To some extent, like yes, if you do like arm workouts and arm days, then you'll start seeing muscle growth in your arms. But for the most part, say like you wanna lose weight in your stomach, because this is usually what people are asking when they're wanting like spot reduction or whatever. You cannot just do 100, 1,000 sit-ups a day and expect to all of a sudden have a six pack. When it comes to getting a six pack or just losing weight in your stomach, it comes to losing weight in all because you can't just like say like oh I want to lose weight in my stomach and not anywhere else it's kind of unfortunate but you can't do it so you kind of just have to do some cardio along with strength training because the cardio will help you to expend more than you're consuming like we talked about last week which will lead to weight loss and that will help you to burn the fat that is covering up those muscles but then the strength and resistance training will help build that muscle once the fat is gone. So in order to lose fat or to gain muscle, it's kind of a combination technique. You need to do some cardio and do endurance activity and then also do some strength and resistance training. Don't just spend hours on the treadmill, but don't just spend hours in the weight room as well. It's kind of a combination of both if you want to lose fat and see that muscle. So. Hope you liked this Mythbuster Monday, and until next time, hope you guys have a great day. Love you all and all your support. Subscribe if you aren't already, and click the thumbs up. Bye, guys.